Hi, I'm Dave Dooley, the president of the University of Rhode Island, and we're here today for the ALS challenge, the Ice Bucket Challenge. I was challenged to this event by my good friend and colleague, Chris Paxson, the, the president of Brown University. Since Brown and URI are such great partners, I felt compelled to honor her challenge. But I have another personal reason to be here today. My mother actually died in part from ALS, and so I'm pleased to support research and treatment for this debilitating disease uh, in this country and elsewhere. I'm joined today by a number of colleagues. We're glad to have Rhody here, who will not get wet. <laughs> and I have to extend the challenge to uh, a few other people. Uh, first of all, our two newest coaches, uh, Jim Fleming, coach of Rhode Island football, and, and Daniel LaForce, coach of women's basketball have both agreed in advance to accept the challenge. Not that I gave them much choice about this, <laughs> you, but they're pleased also to help support research and treatment for ALS. Also challenged today will be Bassam Nasser Sharif, who's the chair of our faculty senate, who will be taking the challenge on behalf of the faculty, and Dean Ray Wright, the dean of the College of Engineering, who agreed on one condition, and that is I had to use this opportunity to say, Vote yes on four for the new <laughs> College of Engineering building facilities coming up this fall. But thank you all for your viewing and for your support of the University of Rhode Island and for ALS. We're ready. <laughs> Hold on. Doing the honors are our athletic director, Thor Bjorn, and my chief of staff, Michelle Carreri, because they have to put up with me more than just about anybody else, so I thought they deserved this opportunity. <laughs> Ready? Ready. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> Is that all you got? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.